All right, hello, fun, and welcome back to my Fallout 4 mini series of Talon Company Mercenaries, where today we are right where we left off in the last episode after, ha oh boy, fighting quite a few gunners and finding, of course, the corpse of one Talon Company mercenary. And we now have the mission to head westward to go and, uh, well, kill them all so that they do not get a foothold here in the Commonwealth. Well, that was at least what the gunners were trying to do and we're just sort of taking up their uh, mission there which before we do head over that way I noticed it when we were in the last episode but didn't actually think much of it but figure I should go back and look at it now just in case yeah this gunner sergeant right here has a set of orders I didn't think about it before thinking oh, it was just something normal in the game but what if it is in fact involved with what we're doing now let's see if that has anything to do about Talon company and why this particular group might have been there so head on down to orders let's see what we got orders guard north access to overpass stay your post until lieutenant royce arrives with reinforcements from quincy an order is given to start the assault kill every talon merc on site command okay so it was involved in this magnificent yeah when i saw it i just kind of thought to myself oh just gunner orders as per usual but uh nope nope so that is what they were up to they were holding this position until the reinforcements came that we then had to deal with and they were gonna head onward to kill the talent company people neat which i mean i don't understand why we are taking up <laughs> This particular mission but such is the quest that we have been given so let us head on over here and take these guys out shouldn't be that blue go what was that uh sounds like they may be encountering some oh <laughs> it is talent company and then since oh perfect i have some help <laughs> Oh, uh, they're over by one of our, our, our uh, checkpoints. Awesome. Well, that's actually pretty great that I'll have some assistance here. All right, where were these guys? Oh, there's one over there. You know, let's get out a sniper rifle. And... Ooh, didn't kill him in one. And I missed. <laughs> oh, my God, I missed again. There we go. That one's dead. Oh, we got one coming straight at us. Ooh, didn't actually mean to shoot him in vats, but no oh well. It did some damage. And hoop. Oh god, he stopped moving. Okay, okay. I need you to die, please. There we go. Thank you. And no, not the synth leader. I no, 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 no. Okay, apparently those are the only two I can see. Got it. Alright, so are these actually hold on a moment. Yeah, I was about to say, it's like, shouldn't we have needed a bit more distance to get to where we're heading? Yeah, okay, so this is just some talent company mercs that were, I don't know, just coming down the road or something? Well, you guys handle that. I'm gonna just, you know, loot these things. Let's see. Ooh, oh, well, we don't have a helmet. We did steal some of their armor last time. Okay, fine, let's help finish this guy off. Oh my god, it went over to the sense again. There you are. Hello. And, ooh, you have the same gun as me. Hey. And you missed both of those shots against me. You fool. All right, I'll take those. Ooh, do you have... D hey, okay, that was one of my complaints last time about the talent company armor that we did get our hands on. It was a full outfit where we couldn't use individual combat armor pieces but this one is in fact uh, the full set of things we've got the helmet fatigues and all the different pieces of talent company armor Ooh, i like that we're taking all of this except for the helmet we already picked up a helmet earlier neat oh that's great oh nice yeah that was definitely a complaint i had last time it didn't make sense that we uh just had the full outfit i'm gonna take those off of you thank you Thank you for your assistance and your sacrifice since Striders. I appreciate it. Oh, God, what the? What did I just get bit by? No, not you. Nope. Oop, there we go. A Talon attack dog. Oh, I'm sorry, dog. Oh, it's not your fault you had awful people who were your masters. Oh, I'm so sorry. Well, he had a skull bandana. That's nice. <laughs> Seriously, though, where was the other body? 
And where did that dog come from? Huh. Ooh, I'll take all of you. And yeah, you're just using the same overall outfit. Interesting. All right, well, let's get over here. Ooh, looks like they're up. Oh, are they going to be up there? Huh. I don't see them, but considering what the compass is saying, that looks like that's going to be the case. Yeah, did I not see anything? Oh, I found one! <laughs> well, let's just pop that off. There we go. Sneak attack damage. That was the only one I'm seeing. Oh, there's one! Oh, and I can't, I can't get to him, though. I can't get to him, though. Oh, come on. Any more? Any more? They're all, like, right up there, but they must be behind those things? Also, what just exploded in the distance? Whoa. Something's going down over that way. <laughs> well, that's not my problem. Okay, what do we got? Yeah, still not seeing any of them up there. I mean, that's obvious where they're going to be, but hey, we're back to hidden. So that's good. Let's try and get another angle on them. Maybe go up this hill a little bit more. I like to snipe as many of them as I can. Oop! Oh, and they, they see someone. All right, so they're all heading that way. Hmm. Nope, oh, there's that dude. Oh, I, I'll never hit you while you're moving. Please stop moving. Okay, okay. So yeah, they're all up over there. I'm getting experience from whom I don't know. <laughs> hmm. Oh man, I saw a cup. Oh, there we go. Got him. All right, and we're hidden, so no one saw that death. All right, so all those guys are over there, and then with my luck, it looks like they're all behind the truck. Ooh, never mind. And hit. Get him. Stop with the breath. Okay, okay, yeah, looks like they're all up that way. They must have gone to check out something, but... Now I don't see them. That sneak damage is some real good damage to them, though. Gotta love that times two. Hmm. Yeah, not seeing them. Okay, let's get out the problem solver and just go up there and solve our problem. Nice. Charge the enemy position! All right. What do we got? Oh, that's probably... Okay, so we got that up there. Up the hill. There's only a couple of them, so... We got the Talon Encampment now. Looks like we got four enemies to deal with. Have a grenade! Have another grenade! Uh, I've got ten more. <laughs> Here we go. Hey, oh, they're chucking them back! They're chucking them back! <laughs> we got Captain Weasley. All right, all right. Oh. Well, how could you? All right, there we go. I did ya. Ooh, he's a bit tougher. He is a bit tougher of an enemy. He is almost dead though, so that's good. Oh god, they're yep, they're throwing back grenades. Oh, we got someone over here. Oh, we got a, he's he's also having to deal with a feral mongrel. You know what? You know what? Enjoy the feral mongrel. <laughs> oh, I can't actually get him. Okay, there we go. We got sixty percent there. Got him! Oh, we got someone who went down. Oh, we got a couple more than the ones that I anticipated or expected here, but... Hector! Alright. Oh, the dog's now my problem. That's the dog. Okay, whoops. Now you know, and there we go. Sorry, Hector! Had to be done. There we go. Oh, oh Jesus! <clears throat> All right, we got one more, one more person. All right, hold on a moment, hold on a moment. I gotta. No, that's the dog. Where's the dude? Nope, oh, they're throwing more grenades. Ow, ow. Okay, you know what? All right, fine, fine, fine. We'll deal with you. We'll deal with you, Grant. Grant, I need you. To... Yeah, there we go. There we go. All right, thank you for appearing. God, I'm blind. All right, and and he's dead. Magnificent. All right, and private contract completed. 
All right. Yeah, I am glad we ended that last time. <laughs> so we were done. I was intrigued last episode if they would have included private contract kill Heinz. Okay, that's probably the extra thing we can do. Nice. I was kind of worried when we uh, uh, were where we finished last time because I remembered reading that there are four locations that the uh, quest takes you to and I wasn't sure if they counted Diamond City as one of those locations. Yes, that appears to be the case. <laughs> uh, so yeah, glad we glad we didn't just let it roll through on that one. All right, let's loot these guys with their stuff. Ooh, we got a steamer trunk. Nice. And we still have a miscellaneous mission. I was hoping we'd get three things out of this, but... Ooh, well, it's got some good stuff on it. Neat. Don't care, though. Not my style. But yeah, I was hoping we'd get three episodes out of it, but I'm thinking we're only gonna get two. <laughs> All right, we have some... Uh... It's got a journal. Uh, a green cap, lag bolt, combat armor, but it's not Talon one, so meh. Oh man, that's a good gun too, right there. Stealth boy, stim packs, tings. Let's get the Captain Weasley's journal. Are there any other named ones to grab from anything? I know I killed a few others, but I don't know where their corpses are. They might have stuff on them too. Oh, that was Hector. Did I kill someone up this way? No, nope, that's more of Hector. <laughs> yeah, where was the one that I killed up here? I have no idea. Crap. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, just some cram on that one. Oh, okay, let's take a look at the things that we do have before I forget about them. So, first, let's read the private contract one. Oh, okay, that was the same thing about killing Heinz. Got it, got it, got it. Let's just make sure they are the same note, though. Uh, 3,000 caps. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah, same thing. Okay, so that was just another another one of the contract hits. And so the other one was Captain Weasley's journal. So let's head up here. And a boom. Oh, there we go. We got our mission. The Commonwealth, the boys are wary. It's been a long trek to hear from the capital. I know, right? It was an awful, awful plan to come up here for just one dude. Establish base camp at the end of the freeway. Location is highly defensible. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Blocking off main access to and from the Commonwealth, overlooking the surrounding areas. We have three objectives. The main objective is to take down the target. Second is to map out the Commonwealth. Third is to find out what happened on the squad that previously hunted the target. We'll rest for the night, but tomorrow, the hunt begins. Day one, sent out two recon squads to survey the surrounding areas. One team will head south to scout for a new location and find intel on the lost squad. The other will head east to track down the target. Ordered the rest of the men to fortify our position. We have to be ready in case we attract some unwanted attention from the locals. Day 2. Still no word from the recon squad. Sent a squad of my veterans to check the fort near our camp. Order them to stay low and avoid any engagement as much as they can. We don't know who's entrenched there and how dangerous they are. Came back with reports, but a group of humans, human-like robots patrolling the area, took one down and brought a souvenir back. Best to avoid the fort for now, at least until the recon squads report back in. Day 3. Reports came in from the first recon team. Seems like every viable location has already been occupied by hostiles dug in deep. We can't afford to launch any full-scale attack at the moment. I've already lost one man on our way here, and we're short on manpower and supplies. We'll maintain our position until the second squad comes back with intel on the target. Day four. It's been four days since we've arrived. There's, I mean, yeah, it's day four. Been some skirmishes with local raider gangs, but nothing we can't easily handle. Good news is the second squad finally came back with intel on the target location. Bad news is we've lost another man after their engagement with a local mercenary group called the Gunners. I've read reports about this Gunners back at HQ. They are highly trained and organized, just like our organization. We need to move fast and get the main objective done. We can't afford to engage in an open battle with another group as highly skilled and armed as we are, especially on their own turf. I'll deal with the target personally after he's been dealt with. We're out of the Commonwealth. 
Well, you didn't move out quick enough now, did you? Day five. No point in sticking around. Target's down and the gunners are preparing for a large-scale assault on our position. With a big pile of caps waiting for us, I see no reason to stay here and risk being killed. Then why'd you stay? Ordered my men to start moving out. Send one man out ahead to deliver my report back to HQ. We're able to cover most of the western part of the Commonwealth, excluding areas north of Fort Hagen and the area locals call the Glowing Sea. I'll return once I've convinced command to send a large wreck expedition to finish what I started and establish our presence here in the Commonwealth. The gunners will be dealt with once and I've returned. Got it. Okay, nifty. So, our new miscellaneous thing, find out what happened to the squad of Talon mercenaries. Got it. Do we have an icon on the map somewhere? Okay, that way north. Ah, they're over at the Fiddler's Green Trailer Estate. Got it. I mean, before we do that, though, we're definitely going to go up down this way because there's still more of these guys that I murdered, and I want their stuff. <laughs> I'm a loot whore. I can't help it. There were two people I killed over this way, and it looks like they're on top of one another. Oh, God, there's more red. What? <laughs> Where did all that red just come from? Oh, and hey, more Talon, con Talon combat armor. Lovely. I'll take that. Sure, I did check a couple of uh, frag grenades. Yeah, more Talon combat armor. Alright, yeah, there's still one other that I found, but... Oh, well. And killed. Whoop, what do we got? Oh, hi, guys! Where the hell did you come from? <laughs> We got some retelling company down there. Huh. I just figured it'd be like some normal raiders, but nope, nope, nope. And then we've got their squad over yonder to deal with. Whoop. Yep. All right. Yep. They're shooting. They're shooting. Oh, God. I made it into a tent. That's not what I meant to do. Oh. There was a way up over there? Where the hell did you come from? All right. All right. Take this. Oh, he's mutated. Of course, freaking legendary enemies. I hate you all. Yep, don't get enough action points. But he's dead. Yeah, where the hell did he come from? How did he get up here? <laughs> Plasma infused combat shotgun. Noise. All right, the other two are down there. Oh, that's where they came from. Got it, got it, got it. All right, that one's down, that one's down. And let's get a crit shot on him. Beautiful. And... And he's down. Lovely. All right, that's two more dead talent company. Uh, where'd the other body go? Well, there he is. There he is. Magnificent. All right. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Meant to reload as I looked away, but I don't even need to do that either. All right, well, let's go over to Fort Hagen. Not the filling station. There's usually enemies there. <laughs> Granted, there's usually enemies in a lot of this area, so I don't think any of those places are going to be safe. But, uh, yeah, let's go find out what happened to that squad. And then that'll be it for this little series. Yeah, I was really hoping for a third episode, but it did not take long. <laughs> Oh, uh, cool part about this talent company mercenary thing, though, is if you are playing a longer game and you have this included in there with things already, uh, you can install a patch that makes it so talent company is, you know, more involved in the Commonwealth. You'll see them appearing uh, from time to time fighting other factions and they'll even send hit squads after you, too. Which is pretty neat, but for just doing this little mod, definitely, definitely much shorter of a quest line than I anticipated it would be. You know what, also, let's just... Yeah, there we go. <laughs> nice, now we can see. <laughs> Alright, go low. Oop, 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 oop. See anyone? There might not be people, it might be a... Uh-oh, uh we got monkeys up there. Might be a thing we find their dead bodies. Huh. But yeah, definitely if you installed this mod earlier on in the game and, uh, you know, to encounter all of this, I think it would be quite cool to have them just in the Commonwealth doing what they do. But it says, oh my god, there's three of them up there. God, I hate you monkeys. Alright, let's check what we got. Oh, ghost! 
<laughs> of course, of course. I know. Oh boy, there's a number of you. There's a number of you. No, well, there's still more coming. Where are you at? Oh, there you are. And they're all dead. All right, yeah, and we got a dead man. Find Callahan. Oh. Oh, man, maybe we do have more to do. I mean, we are still, though, at like 20 minutes. And there's the kill Hines, the usual job there. Shotgun shells. Let's check the find Callahan. If it's just a quick hit that we're meant to do. <laughs> sure, why not? Uh, do, 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 do. Okay, find the Callahan. There it is. All right, if you're reading this, I'm probably dead. We've been ambushed by some android-looking freaks at Fort Hagen, and now I'm bleeding to death surrounded by fucking ghouls. Miller's probably dead outside, and that coward Callahan f fled somewhere northwest, leaving me here to die. If anyone in the company reads this, please do me a favor, find Callahan, and put a bullet on that bastard's head, Spears. All right, well, we gotta, yeah, find the last member of the squad. Just one more person to kill, I can do that. Uh, where's the body outside that he mentioned? Just to be sure. Just to be sure. Just to be sure. Uh, I'm not seeing it, and I don't know if I care to look around too much. <laughs> but, okay, alright, so their squad fell apart. They got attacked by the synths that were at Fort Hagen. And then uh, pushed to this locale. Got it. Alright, yeah, I don't see the body of the other guy. Where did he get to? Where did Callahan run off to? Oh, just right over there. Uh, yeah, the transit center. Wait, is that the one that's going to take me to... No, it should be fine. We should still be in the Commonwealth there. <laughs> it's been so long since I used those points. I couldn't remember if that one... If it was that one or the other one that took me to Nuka World. <laughs> Honestly, by the time this loads, we probably could have just ran over there. It wasn't far, but... Oh, yeah, that was probably a mistake. But hold it. Okay, we're still in the Commonwealth. Thank God. <laughs> oh, I never remember. It's been so long since we used that. Okay, and let's check this out. Yeah, I was... You know, when we found the body and it said the fine Callahan thing, I was really thinking to myself, oh, man, maybe we could... Oh, I can't go that way. Maybe we could turn this into another episode. But no, no, it was... Easy to get to him. Okay, god, yeah, we got a lot of invisible walls over here. Uh, but, yeah, Call Callahan is probably right here. You know, maybe dead. We'll find out momentarily. He's only 20 whatever units away. Hey, he's dead. <laughs> well, hi! Milo? <gasps> Can I get a dog? Hi, Milo. I mean, we already do have one. Callahan's rifle. Can I interact with you, Milo? No, my oh, poor Milo. He's just stand next to his. Next is old master's body. All right, well we got. Let's see, that was it. Uh oh, uh oh, oh hi! Oh, Alpha Deathclaw! Yes, go Milo, kill, help me. Good job, Milo. Who's a good dog? I wish I could take you with me. All right, so Callahan's rifle here. What is that? Fifty percent more damage against humans. Not bad. Problem solver still better, cause you know. It's the problem solver. But that's not a bad rifle in the slightest. Okay, okay. Milo, can I... No, I can't interact with Milo. That is unfortunate. Talon Company helmet there. Already got one. Oh, <laughs> he was eating death claws. Oh, he ate some death claw eggs. I was about to say, it's like, was that death claw supposed to be here? Or was that from the mod? It's looking like it was from the mod. Dude was eating death claw eggs. And mama came to murder. <laughs> All right, well, since we're only at 24 minutes, uh, and that is everything, I do want to head to Sanctuary real quick to see what sort of upgrades the Talon Company outfit can do. I assume the combat armor will just work like normal combat armor and that sort of capacity with the sort of modifications you can throw on. But I am intrigued by the, um, yeah, by the outfit to see if it has anything you can add to it. 
but definitely cool that we did get because I was real annoyed that it was just an outfit. I mean, it looked cool, granted, but it was kind of annoying that it was just an outfit. So it was very nice that we found their fatigues and their proper combat armor pieces so you could give yourself more protection than you otherwise would have with just an outfit, which is very cool. And yeah, like I said, there are the uh, different patches for this to really add in quite a number of different compatibilities for this mod, make sure that you can see them more in the Yo, world, etc. So that's all pretty cool. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, the normal pieces looks like we can do the typical things. Oh, and it's just a paint scheme. Okay, okay, it's just a paint scheme like the gunner stuff. So it's just normal combat armor. Fair enough, fair enough. That's what I kind of figured, but... I was intrigued to see if it would have been anything unique. And the fatigue's just the normal thing with a weave. It doesn't look like, though, the outfit can be modified, because I'm not seeing it in here. Yeah, the outfit is unmodifiable. So really just the putting normal Talon Company paint scheme onto normal combat armor. Fair enough. Fair enough. All right, well, you can at least add on some Ballistic Weave onto this, which is pretty good. Yes. To add you some more defense, not too shabby at all. But yeah, disappointing. No Talent Company helmet in here either. Oh, that's sad. But oh you well, that's what you all. get. Oh, There's and Preston, I, I don't care. I don't care. You're going to hate me forever because I sided with the bandits and conquered Nuka World. Go away. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that is, or rather was, Private Contract, Talent Company, Mercenary Mod. A bit shorter than I was hoping, but still a fun little mod, and it was great to see Talent Company back in the world again. And with all the different patches this does have, it offers you a lot more possibilities for integrating into your game, which is always neat. So hopefully you all have enjoyed this one, and you do come back for whatever mod we do next. Probably going to be another one from the past, from my list of things I haven't gotten to yet so uh, we'll see we'll see though but yeah hopefully you uh, do come back for that but until that time thank you for watching as always well have a good one